All right, got some gears, or actually sprockets, but what we're gonna do is attach the, uh, these little motors here, instead of just being directly connected from there, from the motor to the drive hub here. We're gonna connect the motor to this little one here and uh, put this one on the inside and try to gear it up a little bit. Got some bearings and also got got a shaft there. I'll have to do some cutting, break the chain, and uh, somehow mount it all up in here. Just a open area right now. So, all right. Step one, take the old motors out. Then I'll take these bearings here, the square ones. They're gonna slide in right down on the inside here. Take the place of that. So. All right, we got the motors out. So, plenty of room in there. Here's the motors. They're not very big at all. I think they're big, but that's all they are. Little motors. All right. So I'm gonna take these guys here. Like I said, I'm slap them right inside here, and uh, be ready to go. So I got the new bearings installed on the side, plus got the center ones in there as well. So as you can see, got the gears in here. Uh, everything's kind of still loose right now. I still need to cut between these two. Uh, that's going to be cut. Uh, so each side, driving the sprocket out here. Uh, here's the little motor. I gotta rig this up. So basically, a little gear down here. The chain will come up here and drive this. And I'll drive this to the track. So. Yeah. I think that's uh, <clears throat> definitely enough for tonight. It's pouring down rain. 